hello everyone welcome back to my channel i am kc and this is kc's joy where i make videos about um dolls and dolly things and miniature things that bring me joy and today i have a package uh, unboxing of sorts um to share with you so um i like the fresh dolls y'all know how much i like the fresh dolls so on their website a long time ago they had an outfit for the guy um and it was sold out so i went on the waiting list and i have been on the waiting list for so long i can't even tell you how long i've been on the waiting list that's how long it's been so finally though um i got a notification that they were back in stock i was so excited i um went and ordered and i think i was so excited i ordered two of them and so i got two of the same outfit but here it is this is the outfit i'm not mad about it because who doesn't like animal print so this is um an animal print shirt with a pair of black jeans so we are going to open this now i'm gonna tell you the picture that i saw i'm gonna take the plastic off while i talk the picture i saw on like the website the jeans look different than the picture i saw so on the website it might have been you know staging and everything um the jeans were distressed ah i see it these jeans are a little distressed they're not as distressed as on the um website but they are a little <laughs> it's a little distressed so here it is outside the package so that is the top and the pair of jeans and now the jeans are black so you see there's a little distressing right there so we'll see how it looks once i get it on the guys so i am going to do open both packs because i have two models um here that we're going to try it on so this is mohi he's my main guy um we haven't seen much of him because life has just been a lot and so i've been doing a lot of other things so we haven't seen much of mohi but this is mohi and he is on a broad articulated body um and you will see the body that the body doesn't match with his head but i don't care um he's on a broad articulated body um i believe he's on dumbledore and i feel like y'all remember i did a video about that and then we have this guy that i never use but he's a fresh dog <laughs> i covered his head because i never use him because I just don't use him it's something about the hair and the face i just don't and i see other people use him all the time but it's something about me that i don't use him so honestly i really need to go ahead and take this body and um donate it to someone else the only thing about the fresh doll body is the head doesn't have any movement it only goes that way there's no up and down for him to look you know that's the only thing about the body so i'm gonna open both of these um both of them and dress both of them so that you can see how they look on both bodies now both bodies are bigger than a classic kin body and that's why i like these bodies because you know i love my curvy girls and of course i love my broad kins i have quite the collection now so yeah we're going to try these on and we'll be right back okay so i have the guys dressed and um i will say that if it's the broad guy hmm I think it looks a little better on this guy because of course it's a fresh doll so it's probably is made for the fresh dolls <laughs> but um so like I said the distressing 
you really can't see. I will have to shrink. That's the distressing. So I thought it would be a little bit more. You can slightly see right there. So it's a little bit of distressing. I like the length of them. Um, so they didn't cut them short. So I like the length of them. Um, the top is fitted. So it's very fitted on his um, chest. Shows his physique very well. So that's how it fits on the Fresh Doll. And now on my broad articulated guy, the top is fitted a little bit more around here because he has a little bit more around here. He doesn't have a six pack. And the pants are not as, quite as long, but you know, they're long enough. Uh, his knee, I don't even think the distressing is under his knee. Um, that's how it's sitting on him. And also, the pants, we had, let's undo this a little bit. We had a little bit of difficulty with the pants. Like, yes, you can see the Velcro is not all the way Velcro. I mean, they're not going to come off if I'm taking pictures of him standing up or he's just standing up. Um, talking to Miss Chris or whatever, then I don't have a problem. If he sits down, then that's going to pop open. So I can show you the difference on the fresh dog guy. His hands just velcroed. And actually, I think they were a little loose on him. Like, it seems like I could move it around a little bit on him. But his thighs are thicker than mohi thighs. And you can even see that a little bit. His thighs over here are technically thicker than this mohi. Than this baddie's thighs. Mohi's midsection is what's thicker than this guy's midsection. midsection. So, and I didn't think mohi was taller than this guy, but... I guess his Mohi's well, legs are a little longer than the fresh dog legs, but they actually, um, let's see. Yeah, you can tell they're actually really, honestly, the same height. I think it's just, um, Mohi fills out his pants a little bit more than the other guy. But yeah, I'm, I am very happy with these purchases because, of course, this shirt will probably go on one of the girls also like this is an animal print animal print shirts work on every, anybody and so and we have another pair of good pants for our um male dolls so i'm happy with my purchase um at the time this outfit was still available well let me rephrase when i received my package which was a couple of days ago um this outfit was still available i will put the link down in the description um box for this package and I, for their website and you know their dolls and i'm really happy with my purchase yes they look good they're not twins but they do look good yeah that doll i'm probably gonna give yeah that doll is going to somebody else. <laughs> it's probably Moby. But we'll see. I keep saying that. But I really do like this um, articulated body. I just wish it was a little browner. That's all. Like, I, don't, I really don't mind. I, I don't mind. You know, it's my play world. So, we already have the storyline and everything. It's just hybrid. So... This is Mohi. I do love Mohi. I think he's awesome. I was thinking about getting some um, flocking hair from I dolled it and like actually doing flocking down here. I do have an extra head of him. I wonder do I have an extra whole body. I'm not sure. But I know I have an extra um, head of his. So I was thinking about experimenting and doing flocking for him. But I'm not sure. And you see... This is what the head tilt, I, don't, I mean, we don't do a lot of head tilting, but that's what you would lose with this, this particular head because their pig inside, one of these heads are rock hard, um, but their pigs inside don't do that type of movement. 
So that's kind of what you lose with this. But Mo, well, he is good. He's happy. Chris is okay over there. They've been separated for a little while. But thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And if you have this set, did you do anything to make the um, distressing a little bit more um, noticeable? Do you have any tips or anything for me? Put them down in the um, chat. Uh, how I can make the just a little bit more noticeable. I mean, it's there, but you can barely tell it's there. And I thought it would be just a little bit more, more distressed. That's what I thought it would be distressed and not just a rip right there <laughs> but i still like it so thank you for watching again please like share and subscribe and i will see y'all again soon bye